வணக்கம் வெல்கம் டு திஸ் வீடியோ ஆன் கிளாசிக்ஸ் இன் நியூர் சயின்ஸ் இன் திஸ் செட் ஆஃப் வீடியோஸ் வி ஹவ் பின் லுக்கிங் அட் சிக்னலிங் மாலிகூல்ஸ் ஸ்பெசிஃபிகலி த நவ் க்ரோத் ஃபேக்டர் ஆர் த ஃபர்ஸ்ட் க்ரோத் ஃபேக்டர் இன் திஸ் வீடியோ வில் பி லுக்கிங் அட் ஹவு ட்ரான்ஸ்போர்ட் ஹேப்பன்ஸ் வித் இன் அன் ஆக்ஸான் ஆர் ஆக்ஸோனல் ட்ரான்ஸ்போர்ட் தி ஏர்லி ஒர்க் ஆன் க்ரோத் ஃபேக்டர்ஸ் த நவ் க்ரோத் ஃபேக்டர்ஸ் and on cell transport cell surface proteins suggested transport happened within the axon and this was a two way transport one is transport of material substances from the cell body to the tip of the axon and also transport that happens from the tip of the axon to the cell body two way transport this was studied in the laboratory of paul weiss which they reported in their 1940s paper where they performed a very simple experiment they just tied or ligated and neuron and they found that there was bulging of the end or there was bulging near the ligation so when you tie substances that were going to be transported approached the point at which the ligation has happened and their bulging so that region of the ligation there was bulging that was found this suggested that this this suggested there was actual material transport substances that were getting transported through the axon or through the axoplasm so this suggested there was net flow of material from the cell body to the periphery so the early experiments and uh, interpretations were regarding how fast the flow rate was or the rate of flow and the pressure within the axon intra axonal pressure other such things but later in the 1960s radioactive tracers were used to trace specific proteins this use of uh, radioactive tracers suggested there was fast transport of proteins by up to 400 mm per day or 40 cm per day that was crucial for various functions of the axon the specific molecular basis was to be found much later along the microtubules this was found to be much later this was discovered much later the exciting studies of the 1980s showed vesicles running or scurrying from one region to another region videographs videos of uh, vesicles moving within the axon in microtubules this was shown in the 1980s these were that exciting studies of the 1980s identifying the critical role or the crucial role of uh, axonal uh, transport essentially means that we are interested in linking transport to the axonal growth so delivery of vesicles and components to the presynaptic active zone or the synaptic bulb where uh, the action all the action is going to happen or is happening also f- material getting transported for maintenance and repair of both axons and synapses not only is such transport happening in axons this is happening also in dendrites both in post synaptic and in some cases also in presynaptic elements so all this material for all these set of videos we referred to the original harrison paper and uh, the original article by hamburger and uh, levy montalcini and the 1963 rogers perry article and uh, weiss and his co of 1948 some of these are available online we'll share with you all these papers those who are interested can check this and these papers are for the previous videos of week 2 all the previous videos of this week the material for those are from these articles so but in this particular video we looked at 
axonal transport and how simple experiments like ligature could show uh, that material is indeed getting transported from one part of the axon to another part of the axon. With this we come to the end of this video. Thank you very much for your attention.